In today's video, I'm going to show you how to get more X followers using Twitter ads. And if you stick with me to the end, I'm going to show you how to follow up with those people so you can turn them in to customers. There's a secret trick I'll send you. Hey there, my name is Brad Smith, owner of Automation Links. I've been doing this marketing stuff for the last nine plus years, helped over 2,500 people, and we are specialists at advertising, follow up, and retargeting with people. And if you want to grow your X, X and Twitter ads are the new place to be. I always say, where's the underpriced attention? And that's where it is now. Back when TikTok was organic and you could get millions of views, that was underpriced attention. When Facebook ads first started, that was underpriced attention. Um, YouTube, you know, there's so many different places that have come and gone. Maybe you're not seeing great results on Meta, Facebook, Instagram anymore. Maybe you've tried Google ads, just didn't see the results you wanted. Maybe you just don't want to dance on TikTok. Twitter and X ads are underpriced. You get thousands and thousands of clicks and followers for pennies per click. And it's really easy to set up. And most importantly, I'm going to show you how you can steal your ideal followers. Now, the number one question I get is, I don't think my audience is on X. Well, all you have to do is go find somebody else that has your ideal audience, see if they have a big audience, and we can steal that. All right, so let's dive in. Step number one, you need to create a really solid engagement post and pin that to the top of your profile. I'm gonna show you mine right here. This one right here gets a ton of downloads, gets people to leave comments, gets people to like it, and most importantly, it gets them to follow me. Now, when I start running ads on this, it'll start building social authority. When first someone first comes to your page, we want them to see your first post has millions of views, hundreds of comments, tons of likes and reshares, and that's gonna build authority and make you look like a trusted resource. And that's what you wanna do on X. You wanna provide trusted, valuable, educational posts so people can learn from you. And if they see that that pinned post has gotten all these great results and helped all these other people, they're more likely to leave their own comment, follow you, and start seeing your posts from there. Step number two, we need to go over to the Ad Center if you haven't set one up, you need to be a premium, uh, some sort of blue check mark. You can be the the least, the lowest plan they have, but you need a blue check mark. It takes about three to five days to get approved. Once you get approved for your blue check mark, you can start running ads. Ads take about a day or two to get approved. So think of this as probably about a five to seven day setup to get your ads going. But once they're going, you're good. They don't have all these crazy bans and shutdowns like Meta and Facebook have. You want to be able to just get this set up once and you'll be good on your ads from there. And we're gonna choose the advanced setting. So you're gonna see here that it's either gonna give you just a quick, simple ad, or you can choose the advanced ads. The quick, simple one is like doing the Facebook boost and you just don't get those results that you were looking for. It's just gonna send it out to all the bots and all the random people that aren't really interested in your service. So we're gonna choose advanced and then we're gonna choose reach. Step number three, we need to find the right accounts to steal the audience from. So if you think about it, you might not think your audience is on X, but if there's another account like you, even if it's a software account, they probably already have your audience and we can go choose those accounts to show our ads to. So as an example, maybe you're a website designer. You can go show your ads to other agencies that have clients for website design. You can go show it to Shopify audience, to Webflow audience, to Figma audience. You can go take the audience that they already have that you know those people are interested in websites and you can show your ad to them. If you're an e-commerce business, you can go to a competitor, maybe let's say you do golf, go to another golf company and they have the audience that's interested in golf. So you wanna go find those audiences that other people already have and we're gonna plug those in here into the follower lookalike. That way your ad is only gonna show to those people because you know that's your perfect audience. Step number four, this is where you're gonna go choose your existing post and choose that pinned post that's at the top. We want this to be the highest engaging post. If, you, if you're not sure if it's new, feel free to test out multiple organic posts here. So usually we start with maybe five to 10 organic posts that maybe have gotten good comments in the past, maybe a few likes, and if you're brand new, just throw a bunch in there and see which one gets the best results. Whichever one gets the best results, go back and pin that to the top of your profile. That way you can build that social authority. 
Now, last but not least, run this for a couple weeks and you can come back here in the settings, click on the columns and you can actually choose to show how many followers you've gotten from this ad. You can also see how much it costs per follower. We have accounts getting followers for a penny, a penny per follower and your ideal audience is magic. That's how you truly can grow a profile, grow your authority and get more leads. All right, so I want you to comment blueprint down below and I will send you my guide on how to follow up with these people now. That's the key. It's great to get all these followers, but how do you turn them into a customer? And if, when I send you my guide, you're gonna see where I tell you exactly how to leave comments, how to follow up with them, how to send them the DM, and what to happen after they come and follow and leave a comment. So thanks again for watching this video. I hope it brought you a ton of value. And if you're a little bit more advanced and you wanna learn more about X ads, I'm gonna recommend another video here where I actually break it down and show you how to set up advanced Twitter ads so you can follow up and retarget these people. Pretty cool stuff. Thanks again, and I will see you on the next video.